Shalom, call Halim La Yahweh Baha Shem Yahweh Shai Baha Shem Rahakwadash. Double honor side teachers to head apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace, love, and salutations to the elect scattered throughout the four corners of the earth. Teaching in truth, sincerity, and diligence for the sake of Yahweh Baha Shem Yahweh Shai. Lord, wouldn't this lesson be edifying the street to the point? It's the book of Isaiah 55 and verse 6. Seek ye the Lord while he may be found. Call ye upon him while he is near. You see, and right now, you know, the Lord, he, he can be found, man, and he's near. You see, because, hey, the internet is still up, you know, and that's where you can find the words of the Lord at, man. You know, via social media, YouTube, hey, the prophets still out on the street. The prophets still putting up videos that rivers of living water is pretty much still flowing. You see? And it's the perfect time to seek the Lord, man, because America is still America is still a functioning society. All right, you ain't gonna be able to seek the Lord when everything pretty much start to go down the drain, man. You know, and that's kind of like with Jake. You can't fuck with Jake when he up, man. You know, if you went at him at his lowest, if you went with him at his lowest, you can't be with him at his height, man. And that's the same thing with the Lord. You can't you can't benefit from you can't benefit the the blessings. That you how about Shmuel Shai got in store for us? If you ain't laboring, you know, laboring for him, man. Huh? You know, or rather seeking him. You see, he said, "Let the wicked forsake his way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts, and let him return unto the Lord." You see, because ultimately, hey, the Lord is where I rested, man. You know, you how about Shmuel Shai pretty much brings forth clarity, you know, by way of prophecy. You see, and clarity brings forth comfort. You know. Hey, you got a different spirit on you when you don't know what's going on. Hey, that's that's room for chaos, man. You know, that's room for confusion. But when you know the things to come, and and hey, even in the time of chaos, in the time of famine, you know, we know the famine coming. But, hey, we got comfort because the Lord said, My servant should eat, but ye should be hungry. My servant should drink, but ye should be thirsty. You see? So those who pretty much serving your how about you shot? It's going to reap the benefits, man. You know, you're going to be protected, man. Hey, the Lord, hey, hey, the Lord is our rest, man. You know, so when you return into the Lord, ultimately you return into your rest. You see, he said, he said, let him return unto the Lord and he will have mercy upon him and to our power for he will abundantly pardon. You see, because, hey, we all need our iniquities pardoned, man. You know. We all then went off and sinned greatly before the eyes of Yahweh by Shemel was shot. And we all need the Lord to pardon our iniquities. You see? But ultimately, you have to return. You have to return back to the Lord, man. You know, real quick, let me kind of park this car. Get another precept. Just pull it up at the plant, man. You know? So, like, get back with me real quick. All right, real quick, just the book of uh, Matthew chapter 11 and verse 28. He said, come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden. I would give you rest, you see. So our rest lie with the how about Shemel Shah. Hey, the Lord tell you that this place right here, America, this place ain't your rest. Because it would destroy you, you know. And America do destroy, it's to, it destroys your spirit, man. You know, it, it, it makes you... Abom abominable in the sights of your how about Shemiah Shine. When you go into that word ab abominable, you know, it means uh uh distaste, you know, uh strong hatred, you know. And that's what it pretty much America promotes. This place will destroy you. So you shouldn't be throwing all your eggs in this bag. You shouldn't pretty much be uh invested in this system. You see, because this system is gonna fail you and it's gonna collapse, and we see in the collapse of this system take place. You see, but I rest live with the Howard Shah. You know, he said, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. You see, take take my yoke upon you and learn of me. You see, seek him. For I am meek and lowly in heart, and ye shall find rest unto your souls, you see. So I rest live with the how about Shemel Shah. Hey, the Lord said, The thoughts that I think towards you are thoughts of peace and not of evil to give you an expected end. Hey, when you come unto when you come to Yahweh Bashim Yahushan, you seeking the Lord, he pretty much brings forth clarity to you. The Lord said that he make a uh matter of fact, let's grab this real quick. Um Psalms. 
Psalms 19 to 7, the law of the Lord is perfect, converting the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making wise the simple, you see. Because ultimately the Lord pretty much makes you a prudent man. You know, you're able, you'll be able to foresee the evils, you see, because he, the Lord pretty much going to reveal his secrets to you. And his secrets are these prophecies, the things that are to take place in the coming days. You know, and you'll know how to hide yourself. You'll know how to find rest. You see, and the rest is within these scriptures, within his word, man. You know, and that's pretty much why Jake gonna be left out, and they gonna be confused, and they they pretty much gonna get consumed with confusion, man, and consumed with chaos because they don't know the Lord. You know, uh, it's Jeremiah seven and twenty three. He said, "But this thing I command them, saying, obey my voice, and I will be your power, and ye should be my people, and walk ye, and walk ye in all the ways." That I have commanded you That it may be well unto you You see So the ways that the Lord Yahweh Shemal Shai has commanded us Is going to be well unto us in the coming days You see because the Lord said When well, he said I, I have given you straight commandments On what to do to avoid punishment You know So hey, ultimately following Yahweh Shemal Shai And his wise counsel Is going to exempt us from punishment man Hey that mark You know you're going you're gonna to receive that mark of exemption you see, a verse 24, but they have, but they have, so like, but they hearken not, nor incline their ear, but walk in the counsel and the imaginations of their evil heart, and went backwards and not forward, you see. So by you not seeking the Lord and you continuing in society and you furthering your investments in America, hey, you walking, you walking backwards and not forward and you're going to reap the benefits of your labor, man. You know, you're going to be destroyed or you're going to be left out there to deal with the calamities, man, that's soon to come and consume America. You know, you're not gonna find rest. The Lord said there's no there's no peace unto the wicked. You see, so you're gonna be consumed with chaos, terror, you know, you're gonna be beaten with sore strokes, you know, you're gonna be consumed by the famine. But ultimately if you return back to the Lord, you know, he's he'll he'll pardon your iniquity, man. You know, and you're gonna find rest. We really could just get this last scripture. It's Jeremiah six six and sixteen. Thus said the Lord, Yahweh Shemal Shah, stand ye in the way and see and ask for the old path. Where is the good way? And walk therein. You see, and that good way pretty much goes back to his law, statutes, and commandments, which is going to do you well, man, by hearkening to the voice of Yahweh Shemal Shah. Hey, using wisdom, understanding that we can't keep the law, statutes, and commandments to the best of our. I mean, we can't keep them fully here in America, but we can keep those that, that that's, you know, that we can keep as far as import, you know, uh, you know. The, the dietary law and all that But you know you keep the laws To the best of your ability you see he said Walk therein and you shall find rest for your Souls you see but they said We would not walk therein you see and ultimately Israel won't walk in that's why The two thirds going to be cut off and die here in America But the elect is the only ones who are going to be Seeking how about Shemiah Shah in these last days You know but Lord wouldn't edifying to The elect to those seeking salvation to our Lord Yahweh Shah is always giving all the glory and praises to you. How about Shemal Shabbat Shemar Hagadash? Lord, with us next time. Shalom.